It's cat guys, I'm gonna make a lot of noise. We're just gonna be a late rotate anyways. Um and then if the guy's in if if he is in window, maybe make a play and be patient, or he can go for a pick. But a lot of people expect that, so up to you. The guy lurking just kinda wants to bait, but don't bait for too long. Um so you have four people mid, one guy on A can just like, if you guys make a lot of presence, and once they do start fighting, one guy can just like creep out. It's kind of a ballsy play, this guy's smoking ramp here and playing like this. Right, you're fucked, you lose, whatever. Sucks, but most likely he's like triple default under Balk or something, so if you creep out, you should be fine. And then once you get that easy pick, you can kind of just get control by yourself, just like smoke off jungle and tell your team to either run back or hit B. But yeah, like, it's very difficult. Usually people find mid, like at least it's one person. Because if they don't know how to handle mid, they'll send one guy just to hold it from window. If they do, they're sending one person connector, one person window, one person cat. But window's already smoked off, you guys can just isolate your fights and trade. All right. So then, um, if they do play aggressive like that, we'd, we'd probably need to know that uh, jungle smoke, but that connector smoke, for it. Like yeah, an I actually don't fucking know that one. Oh, this one. I know this one, but I don't know the other one. Okay, well, someone can throw that if we're setting up an A play. We know the jungle smoke. Hello? Hey. I'm sorry, I'm late, but I'm here. Okay, and, like, it's crucial. You guys throw these flashes. <clears throat> so the guy's coming up. They need to be blind if they're pushing this. Alright. And I think they might be able to invite you, but I'm not entirely sure. Okay. If uh, not, just go ahead and finish like what you guys are doing right now, and then whatever role you haven't covered, let me. You can force me to land. Uh, you guys should have set bulls, in my opinion. Um, it's not gonna be like set in stone, like you have to like, you have to wait for your entry fragger to run all the way from the back to the front. But ideally, if you guys are setting up executes and it's like a set strat, just make sure your entry guys has like the closest of smoke, or just doesn't throw a smoke and it's like set up and ramp or something. And then you just throw some good flashes for him, send two people out. Just make sure you just actually go trade. It's just the most important part. And if you guys have an INTL, you guys just have to listen to him because otherwise, you guys might as well just pop it out. Alright. The strats are pretty. So, um, what are the five rolls? Um, basically, entry, and then there's a second man. Uh, support IGL op, but they kind of like it's it's kind of wonky. You can have like actually there's a lurk. You could have ideally your IGL could support because um, he just knows everything that's going on timing wise and everything, and then you could have entry plus another one. Uh, have your opera. Well, actually, your opera can go flashes too. Basically, just send. Just make sure you have one daddy entry. Like my brother or something. Actually, maybe guess one second. It doesn't matter. Um, choose another guy. Have your actually your opera flash him out. Have one guy work. And ideally, you want to hit a site with four people. One guy and just. Lurking is honestly super fucking hard. Um, but. Hey, yeah, I don't. I don't think we should have them. To the timings, yeah. It'll it'll take some time. Like there'll be some rounds where you guys just die instantly, and then the lurker just is fucking awkward, just sitting there, like in under cash or something. Um, if you guys don't want to have one, then at least you guys gonna have like a distract slash info player. Ideally, if you guys were like an execute A, he would like be throwing like this mid smoke, double mid flashes, and fucking mulling connector and shit, and then he would just run back to you. And then, 
I don't know, you can have like, I guess you can have like, if you're doing like default smokes on A, you can just have like an entry man close. And then once you throw those smokes out. Okay, here's here's the thing about entry frags. Um, Sean Garris actually did a really good video on it. Uh, if you guys want to look him up on YouTube, he posts some that? interesting videos. Sean Garris? Yeah. Wait, did you say who is that? Yeah. Uh, he was the ex C9 IGL. He's on Miss. Was on Echo Fox too. He's married to a really attractive Asian girl. Yeah. Nice. <clears throat> um, yeah. Just search Sean Garris on YouTube. He'll come up. But yeah, basically, your entry man wants to go out with flashes, whether smokes are popped or not, just to give you guys some room to actually like run out ramp. Because ideally, if if you're a CT, right, and you see three smokes coming over, like CT, stairs, whatever, your first reaction is to pull out this molly and chuck it, right? So what you want is that entry man to, like, come out with the flash, ideally, like, here or something, maybe over, over Valk, and then come out with it and hopefully get a pick on whoever's throwing a molly or just catch someone off guard and then give room for you guys to actually just run out. Um... It just sucks when there's like an opera here, like you're most likely fucking dead. And then, you know, Twitch chat will be like, oh, this guy's a fucking idiot and let smokes pop, whatever. Right? <laughs> um, but it's actually really important that you have someone who's like, I guess that brave about how he plays. Just, it's because, I mean, that it'll win you the round. It, it might lose you some rounds or put you at a disadvantage, but I think it's crucial. Um, and so. one, one problem we have on A is like when we actually do get everything smoked, it takes forever to actually take it and people are just staring at the same angle. Oh yeah, okay, 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 okay. So one guy in Palace, right? You guys know this lineup. Just say you're smoked off, whatever. You want to throw that, your smokes are executing. Hopefully this dissipates by then. You're gonna have an AK, whatever. Either watch this sandwich drop here or watch this bench push. If there's a jungle smoke, I will say about 10 out of 10 times I am pushing the smoke if I'm playing like connector or jungle. Right? I'm right here. And this spot pretty much fucks a lot of people. Um, so I guess as a palace guy, you should just definitely be aware of that or the sandwich drop. First, first guy is most likely swinging out Tetris. I guess towards sandwich would be his route. Hopefully that's this will be Molly by the time he comes out. So he just okay. This off angle is by far one of the strongest, right? Here. I play this about like 75% of the time I play. Cause when this guy's running out right here, here he's not going to look straight here. I mean I will now because I kill so many people that way. When I'm a CT that I will. So you, like ideally you will you check stairs, whatever, you run out. Also, as an entry fragger, you don't want to like it's also the another lane part, right? You're not gonna be like, you know, shoulder peeking all these angles, you're just gonna white swing with the flash. So you'll probably be fine, probably won't be, who knows. Anyways, so you white swing, you just wanna clear all your angles. Mainly, you're just, you're bait. Entry faggers normally don't live. Um, but hopefully you get a kill or two, and then at that point you guys should win around. Other people, as they come up, you maybe just throw a flash over stairs or something. Just delay some rotates, maybe the bench guy or something. And you can have one guy sit here and watch like the sandwich jump through. Um, you don't need three people going on top of fucking top Tetris. I don't like when people go on top of here. Unless I guess they're trying to make a play with like pistols and go up there with a the flash or something. Or you can ask for a flash and you can just jump through it. But yeah, stray away from top Tetris because at this point, you're like, you've delayed so much time jumping on top of here, and you won't, you, you're, like, your angle advantage isn't any much better than just running here and clearing everything. Um, top out should basically be cleared, except for this part. So, as this guy comes up, you can just... Honestly, you're gonna die somewhere. So, just make sure you have good comms. Don't, like, just be like, oh, what the fuck, and they don't say anything like me. Um, say, oh, like, he's triple, blah, 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 blah. Palace guy, you just chill. Don't jump out in sight or anything. Actually, you can swing on default if the guy's killing, like, a person or two. 
Turn on default, and then just come back here. Okay, I, so ideally, third person, or second person is gonna get the trade. Third person is just going towards bomb. He's a bomber, right? Uh, I, mean, I don't like having an offer on this, but yeah. You, normally, there'll be three people coming in, or you have one jungle here. Stairs CT, yeah, okay, so these two will be late. The guy throwing CT in stairs, and this jungle guy will be trading the guy who runs out. Hopefully. And then, yeah, those two come out. And at that point, like, the round's either over, or you have the site. Right. So if, if your two teammates are dead and you guys are walking out ramp here, you guys can take your time. At that point, like, both your teammates are dead, your palace guy is maybe, like, lit or smoked off, mollied. You don't need to just, oh, fuck, like, I need to get in sight immediately and just fucking die, right? There's no point for that. So at that point, you can like kind of slow down and take your angles if you want. If they got like fucking zero two, which hopefully doesn't happen, but it will. So I mean, at that point, take your picks. They're gonna like over peek and like try and clear shit, and then you just kill them. Um, but I mean, it's kind of it's hard. Like for B apps, like say you guys are just rushing. You don't want like fucking five people just to all run out the balk. Or just like go on top of the end and just like chill, right? Ideally, you just want to like either molly that or van and have like four people jump out. Yeah. And clear everything. And then you guys all can't look at fucking kid, right? And they can just... it's, it's honestly pretty hard jumping out a window just to decide who's looking where. But you guys want to clear this crossfire because it's one of the strongest in the site and then if cat's cleared just he's most likely here or you're getting off from market but yeah the timing's pretty hard because once you guys do jump out you guys have to clear everything really quick and then stop being visible to this fucking that's rotating um Yeah, I don't know. It's super hard. Basically, you just want to watch what your team's not watching, but at the same time, be ready to trade whatever he is watching. Yeah. And for a uh, B take, I mean, we just generally on just... A. No, no, no. So like, for a B take, oh, B -take um, we uh, we just all go apps most of the time. We never split or anything like that. I, I don't think we're. I think I think we tried splitting. But that's if we are on cat. We don't even have mid control. We just have <laughs> on cat, and then we decide to split. This this thing is like the hardest place to hit, in my opinion. Um, just because there's literally like fucking 15 angles you have to clear. So I personally hate going B. Um, but if you are, you throw that original top mid smoke. I might say it's like fast. You can just throw something like this, maybe like molly the connector or something, and then just run through, and it'll be a fast split yeah. on cat. But the, my success rate for this strat for anything B is like 15%. So, actually, on okay, never mind. Uh, when we are either facing their gun round or like, actually, yeah. Any if they have guns, you're fucked. I think B is like fucking 15% chance to win. Maybe 25 if you actually know that they play 3A, one window, and one B. At that point, if your Agio makes that read, like I wouldn't do it on the eco round because usually people play two on two like on every single fucking map. So at that point, you don't want to like rush the obvious site. I guess you guys could and then rush it again, but that's. Just, at that point, it's a mind game. Uh, yeah, ideally, just molly ban. Have people flash over and then throw like this running flash that I have no idea how to throw. Yeah, whatever. It'll bounce out of this window and then you guys can just jump with it. Clear what you need. And uh, go from there. But, I don't know. I wouldn't expect to win these rounds. Actually, maybe that's a bad thing to say. You should expect to win them. Or want to win them. But... 
Alright, don't get too emo if you guys lose. Alright, um... Everybody good? On Mirage? Minus me? I think so. Yeah. Quickly? Yeah. Alright, what should we do? cover next? Um... It's whatever map you guys want. Can you guys reset uh, and pull me? Yeah. Uh, can you guys try inviting him through Steam? Did it not work? Yeah. It, it doesn't let me connect. No. Okay. Let me... I'm just remaking. So what map do you guys want? Maybe I should I could have showed you guys some actual smokes. Whatever. Oh, we were just trying to learn like really retarded run jumps to the side. Smokes from T spawn, you know? And we were just yeah, yeah, yeah. there's no way. Do you guys have jump lines? No. Okay, I would suggest everyone to get a fucking jump bind because yeah, I got they're legal and everything except for pro games. So there's no point really to not have one. Actually, maybe Premiere doesn't allow you one too. But I mean, there's just yeah. Wait, why are we not finding one? Okay. Um, yeah, get get a jump bind. There's. I have one in my profile. It's like, you know, I'll get it. oh, what the fuck? It actually joined a fucking game. Okay, well, this is awkward. <laughs> All right, let's uh, let's redo that one. Wait, what the fuck just happened? I've never had that one happen to me. Are you guys still in there? Yeah, come in. I you invite. Um, what was I saying? I completely forgot what the fuck I'm saying. Oh, uh, dude, I gotta restart my stupid seats. Go. Oh my god. Is your jump Wait, line jump on T? Is that what yeah, you have? It's on okay. T. Because you guys can throw really, really easy smokes. Um, but you guys look on YouTube. You guys still can find one. You just paste it in the console, or do you have to put it in your config? Uh, for me, putting in console just worked forever. Right. But some people say like, "Oh my God, it's not staying for some reason." I have no idea why. Still didn't choose. <laughs> um, Inferno? We played that. You want to do Inferno? Okay, Inferno's. It's just, okay. it's just one of the map. I don't know, like, so we get four bands, two on each side, and then it's random, right? Yeah. But uh, we usually just go for the passing band. Inferno's, I think, a good map for you guys. Because it's that map's uh, it's one of my least favorite, but I think it's good for teams. Um, I mean, for what it's worth, we we won our Inferno match, but I mean, the other team is not that good. We also had some pretty heavy fraggers, right? 
Oh yeah, and uh, Cedric was playing with us, yeah. And can you guess, go ahead. Just go spectate. <laughs> It doesn't even let you go spectate, that'd be awkward. Wait, can you spectate me from CT? Yep. Oh, what the fuck? Or my brother doesn't need to die. Um, fuck. You guys want to know executes or just like everything? Executes would be good. Uh, yeah, everything. I mean, you guys. Like, okay, uh, alright, I'll just I'll cover the basics. Basically, first spawn. Uh, any round you guys want to do default, this guy is just going to come up and then throw this. Either that, or I guess he can throw it that way too, but whatever. Something like that. Maybe you guys can throw a nade with it. At that point, it'll fish some nades out. Either they double molly and then like throw a double nade down, whatever. At, at this point, like you don't need to send three people there, but. Ideally, you just want to send one molly, just hold for the nades. And then, if they show aggression, like there's, and they're smoking deep, you can just like wait for a little bit. If they smoke here, just shit gets a little complicated. If they did the dope molly, then the smoke. At this point, just fall off of it. Just wait, like two people here, one in Mexi. You don't need a peak mid, because um, if an offer peaks you, most likely you'll die. Another, the two other people. You're just gonna run through alts, just throw this molly. Yeah, maybe the other guy can throw a nade. One guy just wants to get kind of close apps, right? You don't need to push in. If you're confident, you know, they don't really like like apps, you can start clearing your angles, I guess. Um, have one guy go through the wagon or the steps, I guess, now. And then you can like kind of clear boiler however you want. And then at this point, you can either dry peek this fuck, or I don't know, throw some janky flash. And then if you get apps, good. Uh, most likely they're. I can't buy anything. What? I can't buy anything. Yeah, I think you ran out of time. Oh. Uh. I mean, we can restart if you wait. Can I change it from here? What was the com I don't know command. To buy things? Yeah. That impulse doesn't work either. Whatever. Impulse 101. It should. Mine worked. Oh, impulse 101. Yeah. Um, yeah, okay. So, yeah, if you have apps control, most likely double up porch. Uh, somewhere in pit. Could be sites named crossfires with an opera like usually arch side. Um, but that's good, that's kind of where you want them to be. Actually, if they're holding this, uh, what you want to do is yeah, actually just throw what my brother just threw, or I think you can throw this flash. Bro, can you go arch for a second and hold like mid? Is that flashy? Yeah, okay, let yeah. me hold it tighter. Aim. Well, let me not peek. Let me watch for the run out. Is it gonna get me? Kind of. Uh... Whatever. This one's a better flash. You just line up on. <sighs> Fuck, I forgot to line. Can you go back mid? Sand anywhere you want. I think it's this one. Uh... You just line up this roof here and you just throw it. So ideally, when you show all this presence everywhere they're most likely going to smoke this off and if they smoke this off they're most likely playing porch and arch holding mid right you throw this flash you just run with it and you try to get some frags and clear brackets if they aren't here you don't get free frags whatever um this can be like for maybe a tech nine buy if you guys have one and you guys like show presence mid they smoke that throw it get brackets control you don't need to push any further brackets control is just good enough uh, you also don't need a peek once you're there, because if they retake it, and you just get flashed and fucked, it's not good. But at that at that point, once you guys do get brackets, you guys can come back B. Um, so you guys need to retake it. You guys can like throw a flash over here. Actually, I think anywhere at this point. Hopefully, he wants to smoke dissipates, right? 
And then you can either throw another Molly car, or you guys can just like trade. Because these spots are true. They usually won't get more than two. Um, but yeah, normally they do fall off if you throw this Molly, maybe another Molly sandbags early on. Um, so you're destroying presents, banana, and apps. And maybe mid on eco so you can flash through that. Uh, okay, so once you once you do have it, you just set up for excuse and you just win the game. Um, a is a lot harder too, but whatever. This one's a CT smoke. Then I'm at the doorbell. I just aim at the top of the smoke. And it actually gives pretty good vision if you want to clear boost. But whatever. I know two other coffin smokes left of the whatever the fuck this is called. You go like three quarters up in between these two little stone things and then go over the first patch of leaves and this should work I hope it's been a while since I've been here oh, wow. I, ideally you don't want this gap because the guy can like maybe one way it or something so I think you throw it lower like halfway I don't know there's also another one I can throw if this one doesn't work Good enough. Or you can go on these logs, and it's this pole and like halfway in between these black wires here. I think. I actually like this one better. Um, if you guys want to learn rap smokes, kind of neat. Um, I've made a mistake. Bro, do you know the rap smokes? Oh, shit! Wait, no. Rap. Uh... Wait a minute, I think I got it. Let me just test before I mislead you guys. Oh, fuck. No. This one's actually a pretty cool execute, too. I literally forgot. Oh, I think that's it. Nope, it's not. Whatever, okay. You guys can look it up. The smokes land here. Here. Then you throw... <sighs> this one. <laughs> Fuck, man. Alright, whatever. You guys can look <laughs> it up. <laughs> it's been too long. This one. This one. And then this one. Oh, so you go through construction? Yeah. So you have... Mm, two or three people go through construction. Uh, maybe you can throw like one flash over from here. Up to you. But ideally, you just want to run through construction. And once they get here, um, they trade her properly. Maybe it was like. If they get traded out, it's still one guy here. The rest are two people. These are smoked out. Oh my god, I might forget these two. Thank you, aim. Yep, no, I forgot. Alright, oh, actually perfect. Underneath this thingy. I don't know what that is. And then this one you just... <laughs> Fuck me, dude. I'll just show you guys these ones. It's a disaster. This one's... This one Molly is Fountain. I actually don't know the freehand for the other ones. Uh, this one Molly is New Box. I thought it was this one. Tip. It's a fucking disaster, man. <laughs> this is why I lost playoffs. Just feels fucking bad. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it was the black dot, dude. Alright, just things, whatever. This, no, and 
find one out. I thought it was this black dot in the corner. It's not. Fountain is inside of here. You get stuck. Top left corner. Emo is... Fuck my KZ skills. Anywhere in the sunlight, you want to aim at this first leaf. And it should get this. So you can't hide behind the pillar. And so, ideally... Default smokes. You guys can throw one here too for like a complete fucking execute and just like bang flashes over. So, so as you're running, you just want to like have someone just maybe throw these. Right, so when they're coming to look at you guys, they're just getting fucked in the face by those flashes as you guys run under them. Um, so ideally, two, three people clear this way, right? And then one person clears that fuck. Uh, but yeah, you guys should have enough smokes, enough mollies for this strat. For the three, not the four. But this is priority. And unless you guys are okay and comfortable with Fountain, then you guys can just molly this off. Hmm, that's all we did for B. That's all I did for B. You guys can run a lot of contact plays if you know they're kind of low economy. Um, you guys have to like make no noise, make sure you have brackets control, and then you guys can just literally walk in. And just be careful of Fountain. At, at this point, you guys can just explode. One person check that, and the rest of you guys just clear oranges and shit. Yeah, contact plays are honestly really strong, especially actually in every fucking division. And then on A, this one's fucking harder. I think an arch smoke is broom and it's on the tip. Fuck. I don't think he can see through this. And then. Oh my god, I'm fucking lagging, man. It's this one. I'm just gonna test it before I teach you guys this. This one's actually a really bad library smoke. Oh, it's... Where my brother is. And then, you wanna aim left of the pot here for Moto. What was library? Nah, I just don't learn that one. Guan taught me a different one, I just forgot it. I think it's... Um, yeah, you guys can all just, I'm just like going pretty fast because you guys can look at these online. Oh, fuck. What was this one? Kind of got library. It's fucking another disaster. What's this? You know, you know what <coughs> Gambit it does? Oh, it's not that. What do they do? Smoke, they smoke this and arch. Oh yeah, for yeah, default control. That smoke is on this pointy dot. You want to line. Like you see these two like brown lines. You just go until you see this brown circle. Jump through, I think. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously, there's a. Fl but concepts, right? Uh, this smoke's just for lurks. You guys can either boost on top of here. And just like slow work a pick. You can jump on top of Borch actually if you want to. Maybe just like molly to fish him out. But this map's all about... At, once you get control, you just want to throw an execute. A executes are a lot harder. But they do work. Um, Whoa. Whoa. How'd you do that? I don't know. You passed it out. <laughs> Fuck, man. It's honestly a disaster. I don't want to go back to a league like this. Well, clearly, Inferno's not played at a high level. Otherwise, he'd know. <laughs> uh oh. Oh, that's cool. Fuck. <clears throat> it should land and cover it, but. Yeah, you guys can throw. Okay, actually. 
if you guys want to get super like strategic, look up. Uh, I think it's Space Soldiers. It's actually a really cool execute. You start off with the smoke. One guy throws B Molly, so they don't get any info, and then they throw this. Just to fish them off of mid. Then they have one guy from here throwing porch flashes. One guy from here throwing arch flashes. While two people throw this smoke, this smoke, and this smoke. And what they do is, oh no, no it was this smoke. Sorry, not the top out one. And so once they get flash brackets here. You guys just run all the way fucking around. Oh, wow. And then when you fight sight, this is smoked off, that's smoked off, and you kind of just have to look towards sight. At the same time, there's someone flashing from here. Oh, that's cool. So when you guys come around, they're blind as shit, and then you just take the sight, blink pit. You see that was space soldiers? Space soldiers. YouTube it. There should be, like, maybe some other team did it. It's fucking cool. There's end of elk smokes too. You guys can just like jump through or fake it. You guys not like, just make noise and just like four rush arch or something. I don't know. You guys can get fancy. Mm. My go to when I played with my brother for open playoffs uh, was just to get B control with this Molly, get apps control. Fall back, XUB, and you win the round. Because most likely these people will just try and fight and hold the site as much as they can. And if you throw these two smokes and those three mollies, the chance they hold it's literally fucking like 5%. If you guys clear everything and then throw all the flashes. So that should be your guys' go to. You can do wall smokes just to like fuck with them. I doubt people will know how to react to it. Um, if it happens to you guys, somehow uh you guys should just both fall off to construction and if you have three people then all three just sit here and retake b yeah basically if anything happens and they execute on you one you want to counter molly counter flash right in some general direction just to delay for your team to either rotate um and make sure you have an anchor on site so you don't just fucking rotate all five towards b and then they just jump out Balk or something. And also be careful of a lurker here for the guy that's rotating A from pit. Like if they're making noise B and you just want to come out, there's I don't know. I'm I'm most likely here. If this was like if you guys are facing me, and I'll probably kill you. Cause I'm like, oh dude, like free rotate, they're going B and then you die. And then I tell my team to rotate A and then the disaster for the CTs. But yeah, that was a lot. I probably left out some shit, but I don't know. Do you guys have questions? No, it was all helpful, I think. A lot of strats, if you guys want some, you just literally look online. Just YouTube. CSGO Inferno oh, strats, like Krakow Major or some shit. What would you say yeah. about CSGO Roulette? Or Strat Roulette? Do those work? Uh, wait, is that where just one per fucking strat and you guys are just Yeah. Uh, actually, dude, it might fucking work. If some guy's trying super hard to read you and you guys do that shit with him, you'll just fucking. Just crab walk dualies up mid. They won't expect it, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> if that happened to me, I'd, I wouldn't know what the fuck to do. 